Hey, ¿cómo estás, Joseas? Te dio COVID. No, bueno, la verdad que voy a saber, ¿va? pero como este, me enfermé algo de, de gripe y me da bastante tos, por eso estoy. Fíjate que una, bueno, una persona que trabaja para nosotros, eh, ahorita tiene COVID, así es Ah, el sí. estudio y todo eso, y sí tiene, está en la casa descansando. Sí. Pero no... <coughs> Yo de, de repente resultó mi hija, como, como está ella yendo a la escuela, se resultó bastante mal. Y obviamente, pues a los días, este, resulté yo también con bastante, pero me comenzó a hacer una tos bastante fea, entonces, esto que es como unos 20 días de estar así que no, no se quiere ir. Fíjate que ella dice que empezó así como con síntomas, con dolorcito de cabeza, pero se hizo el examen porque se le fue el olfato. Ah, ah Entonces, pues sí. no, no vaya A mí a me ser. dio hace, creo, el... El año pasado creo que me dio a mí. Ajá, pero sí cuesta ahora con tanto, tanto virus que anda por ahí. Sí. Hello, how are you? Hello. So you're kind of sick? Do you have the COVID or something like that? I don't know. <laughs> Protection. <laughs> yeah. Ah, okay, very much. Well. Yeah, it's been difficult, right? I mean, uh, in my work, a lot of people has been sick. And, uh, we need to be careful. I, I remember that I read somewhere that uh, one of the most rainy months is uh, September, right? So we need to be careful. Yeah, it's a difference, difference uh, event, concertos, and uh, eso incrementa el nivel de contagio, los conciertos, lo, el fútbol, la feria. Cabal, si vos contás de aquí para atrás, la feria de consumo acá, hace como cuánto estuvo, <clears throat> por ahí como que hubo un pico. Ahorita hay más de, hay mucha gente en el Hospital El Salvador ingresada. Ya hace poco me di cuenta yo que había bastante gente ahí. Yeah, I was I was checking that there is a lot of people, there are a lot of people sick, so uh, we need to be kind of careful about this um, contagious thing because I mean, if you remember the pandemic, it was very easy to get sick, right? So yeah, even when you when you are careful, sometimes it's, I mean, it's complicated, right? Yeah, in 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 my job, it's very difficult to to protect because we have to talk with a lot of people, and aunque uno no quiera, de repente, pues se lleva las enfermedades. That is true. Yeah, sometimes you take care, but I mean, you uh, work with a lot of people. I mean, that makes yeah. Uh, yeah, and what what my friends here says. It's also true if you go to concerts. I, I know that there is going to be a, a match that Selecta is going to play, right? Yes. When is that match? It's using in, in the work, using the watch their, your hands in, in more people. <clears throat> yeah. So, uh, yeah, if, for example, if you go to the stadium, definitely a lot of people are there sick, right? Because they don't care. Um, yeah. They can get sick there. That is for sure. Dos yeah. metros de distancia ahí no existe. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> no. <laughs> And did you get the vaccine? Uh, the vaccine for COVID? Yes, I three three vaccines. Applicate in my in my arm. <clears throat> only three. three. Yeah, me too. Only only I guess I got only two, but I mean two or three is, is fine. I remember there were four, right? I think four. I have only yeah. two. Four. Yeah, I have only two also. Yeah.
And don't you feel uh, that is an interesting question now that we're, st we're talking about that one. Don't you feel uh, that now, uh, I mean, in the past, you get sick for the flu and maybe you are sick for one week. Now yeah. uh, is 15 days or even 30 days that you are sick for the flu. Have you, have you noticed that? Yeah, because, for example, uh, I have maybe 20 or 25 days since I started with flu. Really? Yeah. In my case, only uh, only one day and symptoms. Después es como se dice. Pasí pasivo era asinto, asintomático o sea no, no me dio ya ya yeah, yeah, healthy is important yeah. it's important yes porque el día que me pusieron la vacuna yo me fui a hacer ejercicio después de hacer la vacuna o sea tenías que acelerar tu corazón para que el, el chip se, se recargara que te colocaron ahí <laughs> ok that is a good tip but I didn't know that yes yes entonces eso como que Ayudado, ayudo un poco. Ok. Uh -huh. <laughs> interesting. Yeah, you know, it's, it's very interesting and uh, how the world has been changing, right? I mean, I remember before the pandemic, maybe nobody believed this was going to happen, right? Yes. Okay. Uh, all right. So let's check about the attendance first. And then we're going to start the class. Aida Isabel Lopez Bonilla. Hello, teacher. I'm Hello. here. Okay, good. Ana Veronica Hernandez Rodriguez. Here I am. Good. Blanca Isabel Tunaca de Rodriguez. Present. Good. Eric Enrique Reyes Martinez. Ernesto José Andrade Medina. Sure, teacher. Good. Ingrid Paola Hernández Tenorio. Here, teacher. Good. Jennifer Esmeralda Amaya Arias. Jonathan Ariel Figueroa Rivera. Present. Good. Jose Alfredo Hueso López. Present, teacher. Good. Juan Roberto Velázquez Romero. Here, teacher. Good. Carla Alejandra Castillo. Here, teacher. Good. María Julia Ramos Olivar. Present, teacher. Good. Mónica Wendy Ábalos Girón. Oscar Mauricio Rivera González. Present. Good. Oscar René Molina Calidonio. Present. Good. Oseas Figueroa Cisneros. Present. Good. Ramiro Rafael Aguilar Díaz. Present, teacher. Good. Roberto Carlos Avilés Rivera. Sandra Yanira Gómez Romero. Present teacher. Good. Víctor Eduardo Reyes Navarrete. Present. Good. All right, my friends, we're going to start the class and get into that one here. Okay, so yesterday we started the book, but we didn't do that much. We're going to start with the conversation. So this is the one that we're going to check right now. And uh, it says, Gina and Nelson are talking about Grand Tortricas, a new product that has been introduced to the market recently. Take turns practicing the model conversation. And... Uh, I'm going to tell you the pronunciation so you can check into that one and then we are going to 
we're going to do it in pairs as usual, okay? So it says, have you tried the new green tortricas? What's that? It sounds like tortillas. They're actually corn chips with avocado flour. Hmm, they sound delicious. Where did you get them? They're not everywhere yet. Only low prices market sells them at the moment. Let's buy some. I want to try green tortillas. Very good. Do you have any pronunciation question? No, teacher. No, teacher. Huh? Teacher, I have a question. Go ahead. It was avocado flavor? Avocado, yeah. Avocado flavor. Okay. Good. Okay. <clears throat> Uh, any other questions before we do the conversation? Okay. Uh, we are going to do the conversations like this. Uh, you are going to, well, for first of all, I'm going to read it so you can check the pronunciation. Then you are going to do it in pairs. And then we're going to check new vocabulary. Okay, so we are clear on all the vocabulary. Okay, so let's start with Ramiro, Rafael, and Maria Julia. Okay. Okay. I am Gina. Um, okay. Yes, go ahead. Okay. Have you tried the new green tortillas? What's that? It sounds like tortillas. Oh. They are actually corn chip with the uh, avocado flour. Avocado. Flour. Uh -huh. mm, they sound delicious. Where did you get them? They are not everywhere, yet only low price market sell them at the moment. Let's buy some. I want to try green tortricas. Very good, Paolo. Thank you. So now we're going to go with Paola and Oseas. Okay, I'm Gina. Okay. okay. What's that? It sounds like tortillas. Mmm, they sound delicious. Where did you get them? They are not yet. On low prices, Mark tells them. Let's buy some. I want to try green tortillas. Perfect. Very good. Thank you. Now, uh, Oscar, Rene Molina, and Blanca. Tulaca. Okay, Blanca, get ready. Have you tried the new green tortillas? What's the, that is so nice tortillas. They are, they are actually come, come chips with, with uh, avocado flavor. Mmm, they sound delicious. Where did you get them? They are not everywhere yet. Only low price market sells them at the moment. Let's buy some. I want to try green tortillas. Okay, very good. Perfect. Now uh, let's listen to Ernesto Andrade and Jose Alfredo West. Okay. I start. Okay. Hey, try the new green tortillas. And what's that? It sounds like tor tortillas. They're actually called chips with 
go, go for it. Mm, they sound delicious. Where did you get them? They're not everywhere. Yet only low price market sells then at the moment. Let's buy some. I want to try green tortricas. Okay, very good, perfect. Now, uh, Eric Reyes and uh, Victor Eduardo Reyes. Okay, let's start. Have you tried the new green tortricas? What's that? It sounds like tortillas. They are actually corn chips with avocado flavor. Mm, they sound delicious. Where did you get them? They're not everywhere yet. Only low prices market sells them at the moment. Let's buy some. Let's buy some. I want to try green tortillas. Very good. Perfect. Thank you. Now, Juan Roberto Velasquez and Sandra Gomez. Okay, I start. Okay. How you tired the new green tortricas? What's that? It sounds like tortillas. They're actually called chip with avocado flavor. Hmm, they sound delicious. Where did you get them? There is not everywhere yet. Only light price market show that at the moment. Let's buy some. I want to try green tortricas. Very good, Thank perfect. <laughs> so now Mauricio Rivera and Carla Alejandra Castillo. Okay, okay teacher. Have you tried the new green tortricas? What's that? It sounds like tortillas. They are actually corn chips with a avocado flavor. Mm, they sound delicious. Where did you get them? They're not everywhere yet. Only low price prices market sells them at the moment. Let's go. Let's buy some. I want to try green tortilla. Okay, very good. Perfect. Thank you. Now, Veronica Elizabeth and Ana Hernandez. Okay. Have you tried the new green tortricas? What's that? It sounds like tortilla. Uh, they are actually corn chips with avocado flavor. Mm, they sound delicious. Where do you get them? They're not everywhere yet. Only low price market sells them at the moment. Let's buy some. I want to try green tortilla tortillas. Very good, perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, now let's see. Aida, Isabel, and Monica Avalos. Uh, is it possible for you, Monica? Okay, go ahead. Okay, I'm going to be Gina. Okay. Yes. Okay. okay. Have you tried the new green tortillas? Hello, Monica. Not possible, I guess, for Monica. I can we can hear you. I don't know if you're talking. Okay, not possible, I guess. Uh, Jonathan, could you please help the partner? Jonathan Figueroa. <clears throat> Hi, teacher. I'm not able to participate in this moment. I'm driving. Okay, no problem. Be careful there. So let's see. Silvia, Patricia, is it possible for you to participate? Okay, teacher. Okay. I am Gina. Okay, that's fine. Oh, okay. How do you try the new green tortricas? What's that? It sounds like tortillas. They're actually core chips with a big couple of flour. 
Apo Kate of Flavor. Uh, Kate of Flavor. Mm, they sound delicious. Where do you get them? They're not everywhere yet. Only low price market sets them at the moment. Let's buy some. I want to try green tortricas. Very good, perfect. Thank you. Uh, Jennifer Amaya. Okay. Okay, with uh, Maria Julia Ramos. Mm -hmm. Are you ready, Jennifer? Okay. Okay. Have you tried the new green, green tortricas? What that it sound like tortillas? They are actually corn chips with avocado flavor. Mm, they sound delicious. Where did you get get them? They are not everywhere yet. Only low price market sells them at the moment. Let's buy some. I want to try green torti torticas. Okay, very good, perfect. I believe that everybody did it, right? Is there anybody missing? Yeah, I guess everybody did it. Very well. So let's check some things. Um, let's see. Uh, avocado flavor. Check the pronunciation. Avocado flavor. What is avocado, anybody? Aguacate. That is it, amazing, I really love avocado. And what is flavor? Sabor, no. Sabor. 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 <laughs> Good, deep, that is deep, it. Deep con sabor aguacate, I'll see. Uh, actually it's not, it's corn chips. Uh, do you know what are the corn chips? Tortillas. Yes, yeah, something. Yeah. Maiz, the maiz. Uh, the maiz. Corn chips. It's like uh, jalapenos, you know, like like the chips. Those are the chips. The chips are like the ones that you use for uh, Doritos or anything like that. Some something yeah. like that. All right, and let's see what else. I don't see any other. What is everywhere? Very good. That is it. Any of those answers is correct. Very good. Perfect. Uh, do you have any questions about the conversation? For me, not teacher. Okay, good. Perfect. So it was a very good first conversation. Nice. We're going to move on and check about the exercise number four. Building vocabulary. So put a check next to the words that are new for you. Uh, so I'm going to give you a few uh, minutes for you to, to check in the dictionary or in Google about the meaning of the words. Okay? And then we're going to, actually I believe that that is that one. Let me see here. No, not yet. Okay, so we're going to check the meaning of that one, okay? And uh, you tell me what is, what are, the synonyms or any meaning of that one. You can say that in Spanish or whatever you want, okay? So just a few minutes because there are just a few words.
<clears throat> okay, let's check. So what is appeal? Anybody can tell me what is appeal? Appeal. It could be something like that. Very good. Appealing, right? And uh, what is take off? Despegar. Despegar. It could be something like that. Yeah, take off. Yeah, growth. What is growth? Crecimiento. Nice. Demand. 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 Very good. The opposite of offering, right? So, differentiate. What is that? Yeah. That is it. There are some products that can be differentiating some parts, right? Some the things. unique product. Something like that. Very good. What is buyout? Comprar partes. Mm, could be something like that, yeah. To, to buy. Yeah, that would be. Discontinue, we know that. Discontinuar. Oh, obsolete. Uh, exactly. When you make something upset, when you want to retire, recall some products. Withdraw. What is withdraw? Retirar. Very good. Uh, saturation. Saturation. Exceso. That is it. Very good. Nice. That is a very good uh, synonym. Excess of something. Okay, so all these words okay. might be related with the topic that we're checking that is the product cycle, right? Uh, let's move on then. Uh, we are not going to use such a set, but we're going to go this. Um, now, this is the discussion that we are going to do. But there are a few words that we can check here. So, for example, what is brainstorm? Lluvia de inglés, de ideas. Very good. That is uh, brainstorming is when you, most likely when you have a problem or when you want to create something, uh, you have people launching ideas, right? So you decide what would be the best solution or something. Okay. Uh, let's see. No, this is part of what we're going to do on Friday. Okay. So let's go to the next part. It says uh, the pro life cycle is the same topic and says I will be able to make suggestions about how to deal with market saturation. And the first one says, would you agree that your company has fierce competitors? What do you think? Do you believe it's a good thing that companies have competitors? Mm -hmm. Is that good that companies have competitors, other companies that compete with them? Yes, it's good to yes. promote the competition. Compete, competition. Compet competition, good. Low prices. Yeah, it's good for the market and to decrease the price, right? Good. 
what other things are good about this. Most demand. Yeah, you can uh, actually you have more offering and then you can satisfy the demand, right? Mm -hmm. In in the good in the good market the picture, uh, we have uh, different competitors. That is true. Uh, almost always we have competitors, right? In all the companies, almost always, okay. and not always, but yeah, there are some companies that they compete. And the other one says, does competition affect business negatively? What do you think? I think it's negative with a, a, a war a prices is very bad, but a lowest all the all the prices the all always uh, always uh, have a bad uh, result results. Okay, so pricing definitely is being affected by competitors. So when you have um, other competitors, or more if you have more than one or two, uh, and uh, people are getting this product, of course, pricing is one of the things that you have to decrease the maximum, but uh, of course you need the profit as well, right? Uh, any other thing that you believe might be negative in this part? I think the obsolescence of the of the tool that I use it to to bring to the to the customers the, the product. For example, I work for Tigo, and now nowadays are uh, different company, uh, different internet company, and that use better technologies. For example, the I, I don't know how do you say fiber optica, and they only use coaxial cable, and fiber optica is better than the coaxial cables, and and the 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 signal is better. Okay, very good. That is interesting. Yes, optical fiber definitely is better than the coaxial cable. And you are right. There are many other companies that they are using these resources. And since that is that provides a better connection on the internet, a lot of companies and also a lot of a lot of people they prefer it, even when the price sometimes is different. Right? Uh, this is very very similar to what we were discussing yesterday. I mean, you go and get the toilet paper. Right? Scott is not the cheaper, but is the one that people prefers because of many reasons, right? So uh, that happens. Competitors, there are always competitors there, but um, it's, it's kind of negative if you have a company and other company is offering different resources, is more up to date or better pricing. So we need to do something about that. And actually these things sometimes can cause global a crisis maybe starts with one point and at the end explodes in different levels good so let's do the second conversation this is a good one uh, it says listen to your instructor read the conversation below take turns practicing with a part uh, as i was telling you i'm going to tell you the conversation check the pronunciation then if you have questions about pronunciation you can tell me then you are going to do the conversation and then we're going to check vocabulary. Okay, and it says, the sales in the last two months were growing really fast, but now they're decreasing. You're right. Although it is no surprise with this, uh, with this competition. I agree. We must figure a solution to deal with market saturation. Many companies would prefer to withdraw the product, you know. However, we have invested a lot in this uh, product. We'd rather launch, uh, relaunch the product that is discontinued. 
Do you have any question on this? Yes, teacher. Go ahead. I have a question. Okay. Uh, pronunciation that's crazy. That's crazy. Uh, decreasing. 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 Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, other question. Go ahead. Uh, and in the part, Rina, however, we have invested a lot in this product. We ready. With ready. Yeah. It's a presentation, please. Yeah. Yes, yes. With, yeah, it's with a rod. With rod. With rod. With like a D, like a normal D, with rod, with rod. With rod, with rod. It's correct. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Any other pronunciation questions, my friend? No. No, teacher, for me, no. Pronunciation and. For me, no. Uh, Paragraph the July, many companies to go prefer to withdraw. Oh, withdraw. Withdraw. Uh, I'm sorry, anybody has another withdraw. question? Thank you. Okay. Where is the meaning of rather? Okay, we're going to check into that one. No worries. That is something that is very, very useful. You will see. It's part of the grammar that we're going to check tonight. Any other pronunciation question? Okay, let's practice then. So in pairs, we're going to do the conversation. Let's start with, let's start with Oseas and Ana Hernandez. Let's see how it goes. Start on. Okay, Rina, the sales in the last two months were growing really fast, but now they're decreasing. You're right, although it is no surprise with this competition. Are we? We must figure a solution to deal with market saturation. Many companies would prefer to withdraw the product, you know. Uh, however, we have invested a lot in the product. We are relaunch the product uh, that discontinued. Very good, perfect, very nice. Thank you. Uh, now Sandra Gomez and Oscar Rene. Okay, Sandra, you ready? <clears throat> Hello, Sandra. Creo que la perdí. I guess she is buying cosas right now. Something like that. Okay. <laughs> okay, so it's going to help you, uh, Blanca Tunaka. Can you hear me? Okay. Repeat, please. Yeah, Blanca, you, you first. Okay. The sales in the last two months were growing really fast, but new, but now they're decreasing. You are, you're right. As though it's, it is no surprise with this competition. I agree. We must figure a solution to deal with market saturation. Many companies companies will prefer to withdraw the products to know. However, we have invest a lot in this product. We'd rather relaunch the product 
down discontinued discontinued all right perfect very good thank you now we're going to listen to ramiro rafael and uh, see ernesto andrade okay um i will be rina okay yes okay uh, the sales in the last two months were growing really fast but now they are decreasing hello ramiro excuse me excuse me okay i have a problem with my computer uh -huh. i am julio yeah yes uh, you are right although it is no surprise with this competition i agree we must figure a solution to deal with market saturation many companies will prefer to withdraw the product you know however we have invested a lot in this product we'd rather launch the product than discontinue it very good perfect nice now jose alfredo and mauricio Alfredo. Okay. Okay. I'm Ahí going está. to be winner if you want. The sales in the last two months were growing really fast, but now they are decreasing. You're right. Also, it's no surprise with this competition. I agree. We must figure a solution to with market saturation. Many companies will prefer to withdraw the product, you know. However, we have invested a uh, lot in the steep product. We ready to relaunch the product that's this point. Okay, very good, perfect, nice. So now we're going to listen to Paola Hernandez and uh... Juan Roberto. Okay, um, Rina. Okay. The okay. sales in the last, the sales in the last two months were growing really fast, but not increasing. You're right. I thought it was a surprise with this competition. I agree. We must secure a solution to deal with market saturation. Many companies will prefer to withdraw the product, you know. However, however we have invest, invested a lot in this product. We'd rather release the product than discontinue. Very good, perfect, nice, thank you. Uh, Carla Alejandra and Victor Eduardo. Okay. The sales in the last two months were growing really fast but now they're decreasing decreasing you're right i thought is it is no surprise with it with this competition i agree we must figure a solution to deal with market saturation many companies would prefer to withdraw the product you know Uh, oh. We have invested a lot in this continuing. Okay, okay, very good. And now we're going to listen to Eric Reyes and let's see, Veronica Elizabeth. Okay. Who we'll start? Uh, you can start, please. Okay. The, the sales in the last Two months were growing really fast, but now they are decreasing. 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 You're right. I thought it is no surprise with this competition. I agree. We must figure a solution to deal with market saturation. I agree. Uh, sorry. 
many companies would prefer to withdraw the product, you know. However, we have invested a lot in this product. We'd rather launch the product that discontinue it. Very good, perfect, thank you. Now, let's see, who has some bread? Sandra has some bread, but she was not really quiet. Uh, Monica Avalos, is it possible for you? Okay, Aida Isabel. Yes, teacher. Okay, let me check. Maria Julia, is it possible for you? Que no podrá iniciar pizza. De nuevo. No possible. Jonathan is driving pizza. Okay, so Aida Isabel and Ernesto Andrade, please. Okay, I'm going to be Rina uh, Jonathan. Yes? Uh, yeah, Rina and Ernesto is going to be good. Ah, I'm sorry. Yes, yes it is. Okay. Okay. Uh, the sales in the last two months were growing really fast, but now they are disgracing. You're right. I thought it is no surprise with this competition. I agree. We must figure out a, sol figure a solution to deal with market saturation. Many companies would prefer to withdraw the product, you know? However, we have investigated a lot of in this product. Well, rather uh, relaunch the product than discontinue it. Very good, perfect, nice. Everybody did it right. Remember that, everybody involved. Okay, so let's check some things. Uh, remember, this is decreasing. Okay, the pronunciation. Although, let's see what else. Deal. Uh, withdraw. The TH sound is important. Withdraw. And let's check the vocabulary now. Let's see. Uh, well, do you remember what is decreasing? Decreciendo. Very good. Yeah, it's the opposite of increasing. Increasing. Uh, what is although? Sin embargo. Okay, any of those is fine. Aunque, sin embargo, is the purpose of that word, okay? Um, what is deal? Tratar. Tratar, lidiar. Very good, that is it. Uh, which I will saturation. Uh, okay, uh, rather is the same of prefer. Okay, so if I say I would prefer, you can also say I would rather. Actually, that contraction, the D is also would. So it's going to be would rather. Okay, and it's exactly the same as prefer. So you can say I'd rather be playing soccer or she rather working from home, for example. So if she prefers, I prefer, that will be it. Okay, the only situation is that prefer is possible to use it with, uh, without the wool. Uh, rather, almost always is going to be with wool. That will be it. Uh, we know what is withdraw, let's see what else. Uh, launch, what is to launch? Lanzamiento. Lanzamiento. Very good. So it's very interesting this conversation because it says, uh, I mean, they are really growing fast. Right? The product is, is very popular, right? But they're decreasing. Okay, so it's growing fast, but now it's decreasing. And then it says the competition is, is the reason why, right? And they talk about the market saturation. So what do you think is the market saturation? Saturation de mercado. That is it, a lot of products. <clears throat> when you have too many products of something, I mean, and then, I mean, a lot of people is buying, but not enough. 
So that is market situation. Too many products on the market. And then is where it says many companies will prefer. So wool, when we use wool, we prefer is like uh, not real, right? They think about that one, but they won't do it. It's not for sure. The same happens here with rather we prefer to relaunch. So launch again, revamp. And uh, there is another word for that one, revamp uh, the product and discontinue because they invested a lot, a lot of money, a lot of time in the product. So it's an interesting situation where you need to decide what to do with the product. Uh, do you have any questions here in this conversation? Yes, teacher. Uh -huh. When we say market saturation, we are talking about products that are the products of our company or products uh, of other company. Uh, it would be products from all the companies. So uh, that makes the market to be saturated. It's very rare. It's very rare. It's possible. It's possible that you can have market saturation because the products of one company but it's not that common because almost never the company competes with itself right uh, but it's very common that we have a lot of uh, products of the same same kind of product from different companies so that is a market saturation Good. Uh -huh. uh, sorry after we'll prefer we have to use two. Uh, not not necessary. For, for example, you can say, I would prefer being. You can use an ing verb then. So is it possible? Uh, depending. Uh, when we are in the advanced, when we are in the advanced module, you are going to see that sometimes you use some verbs only with the infinitive, that is two at the verb. And sometimes we use verbs only with the general. Okay. And there are other verbs that you can use both with an infinitive and with a general. Uh, so it is possible to say we prefer being or to be, for example. So that depends of the verb. That depends on the second verb after prefer. Yeah. Okay. Is the same with other. Uh, it's the same with rather. Uh, most, let me think, uh, most common is going to be a rather, yeah, in this case, as you can see, we use launch and we didn't use to launch. So it's very common like that without the two. So we're actually, we're going to check that uh, below, but it's going to be more common like that. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Any other question? It's nice to hear questions. I really like that. Okay, so now we're going to do the exercise. We're going to do that together, okay? Discuss the answers to the questions based on the information from the conversation. So number one, we're going to check if it's true or false, okay? So number one says, if a company withdraws a, com a product from the market, not temporarily, they discontinue it. Is true or false? True. 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 That is true, definitely. So withdraw is a synonym of discontinue. Okay? But withdraw is a verb that we can use in different situations. For example, when you go to the, to the bank, you withdraw money. So there we can use that that word or the ATM, right? So if you go to an ATM, you can withdraw money. Okay. Number two it says if sales decrease, they stop growing. Is that true or false? False. True. Ah, this is a difficult Ooh. one, right? True or false? True. I okay. It's true. All right. So let's say that in most of the cases, it's true. 
because most of the company they want to sell in some situations might be different but we are not going to analyze that right now but yes in general let's say that is true okay number three it says rena's first option to solve the situation is to relaunch the product the first option Yes, true. Yeah, it's true, right? Because that's what she said. So who says to withdraw is you, Julio. But Rina, this, the first one is to, to relaunch the product. Uh, this is an interesting thing. How will you relaunch a product? What do you think? What you can do to relaunch a product that is not working well? What would you making, do? Making new... Uh commercial uh, in TV or change the presentation, uh, try the new fragrance, uh, maybe. Okay, very good, so? Or, or, or re relaunch with a promotion. Okay, that is a, a very common one, right? Here in Salvador with a promotion. That sometimes, for example, um, I remember that I was checking about mayonnaise with I don't remember what it was. And I was thinking the very first time, oh, that's interesting, but I didn't try it. But then they put together the two products, right? And then you say, oh, okay, I can try. So that is a relaunching. Yes, a two for one. Two for one, I mean, you say that is a good deal. And if you like it, you continue buying that one, right? Okay, what other strategy of relaunching can you think of? Teacher, it's okay if I say um, it decrease the price. Uh, yeah, you can decrease the price. Reduce is more common, to be honest. Uh -huh. But it's correct to say decrease, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, yes, that is another strategy. I mean, when you see that something is not working well, you can reduce the price. You say, okay, not $1 anymore, 99 cents. Ha, that's not a deal. <laughs> yes. if, if you buy... Two products, the third is free. Yeah, that happens a lot. You know, a, a lot of strategies are like that. For example, when yeah. you go, when you go and buy shoes, for example, almost always the second pair is half the price, right? Yeah. Or seventy percent off. So okay. all those things, uh -huh. they they do these things because they want to 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 buy to people to get two pairs, right? Paradox is very, very similar to this strategy. That is true. It's very, very similar and very interesting. It's very convenient for you. I mean, as I was telling you, sometimes you see a new product and you say, it's interesting, but I don't know. So with that second push, you, you go for it, right? Okay. Another strategy. Go ahead. A sample. Sample. Sample, yeah. Uh, so free, free samples. That is another relaunch. For example, in the supermarket, right? Uh, there are some girls giving you, I don't know, food for free, right? A little sample. And you, when you taste it, you say, oh, this is good. And then you can try it, right? Yeah, there are many strategies for relaunching. Another marketing campaign, sometimes with somebody that is famous, or nowadays, uh, the influencers, right? They are something in this yes, nowadays. And, uh, another strategy, teacher, is, for example, reduce the price in the specific week. That is true. That is true. The, the, the market uh, used this strategy. That is true, yeah. Uh, for example, in the supermarket, on Tuesdays, I guess you can buy fruits and vegetables, for a reduced price. And they do that because they know that Tuesday nobody goes to the supermarket. So you can go buy some fruit and other things, right? Because I mean, you say, I'm in the supermarket, or let's buy some sodas, anything else. So it's a very good strategy. Yes. Yeah, companies are very smart, right? We are there buying things. <laughs> 
Uh, it's very interesting. All right, let's move on. Okay, this is the grammar. Okay, for rather, I would rather. Uh, okay, let's see. Um, let me check who's going to read the chart. Oseas, could you please? Oh, you're, you're ready. Don't worry. I see that you're ready. Enjoy your food. Uh, Juan Roberto, could you please help me read the chart? Uh, yeah, and in in fourth. Yeah, uh, where it says Jews would rather everything, all the charts. Okay. Uh, how to use would rather? Uh, it rather. Look at the examples in the box, then complete the exercises below. Use Continue. would rather to express preference. Ah, please continue, yeah. Would rather plus based from the um, of verb. Uh, many companies would rather withdraw the product, you know? We would rather relaunch the product than discontinue it. Mm, the other, rather plus based from the verb, uh, they'd rather withdraw the product, you know? We'd rather relaunch the product than discontinue it. Use the much rather for a stronger preference. This form more common common in speaking than, than in breathing. Something went wrong with the earth in the levels of the product. It must rather hire a different designer. Green tortricas can compete with the low prices of other ships, but much rather lower all prices. Perfect, very good. So now we're going to analyze, okay? So will rather is like prefer. So if I say I would prefer to go to the beach, it is the same to say I would rather to go to the beach or go to the beach. So that would be it's exactly the same. But it's very common to use would rather in English. It's very, very common. Actually, it's more common than prefer. So it's something that we need to get into our vocabulary. Uh, so everybody understands what you're saying, right? Uh, we have would rather plus the base form of a verb. So as I was telling you, here we don't use two, only the base form. So many companies would rather withdraw the product, you know? We would rather relaunch the product than discontinue. So not two here, only would rather and the base form of the verb. Would rather be, would rather go, would rather jump, would rather cook whatever you want to say. And remember that is the same as prefer. And the contraction is uh, this part that is uh, the contraction with the noun or the pronoun. So, and also we are going to continue using the base form of the verb. And we can say they'd rather withdraw the product, you know. We'd rather relaunch the product than discontinue. So it's the same. No difference, the only difference is that you can contract wool with a noun or proud. And the other one is use of much rather, with much, for a stronger preference. So I really prefer this, okay? This form is more common in speaking than in writing. Uh, and the example says, something went wrong with the art in the labels of product. I much rather hire a different sign. So I really prefer, I really would prefer to have a different sign, not the same, to change it. So when you use much is to emphasize, you emphasize your preference. Uh, the second example there says green tortricas cannot compete with the low prices of other chips with much rather lower oil price, okay? So we prefer, we really, I will prefer that the prices are less to reduce the price. So I believe it's kind of simple, but let me ask you, do you have any questions? This is the moment for the questions. If you don't understand something, please ask. Yes, coach. Uh, what is the meaning 
um, something when grow with the R in the levels. Levels. Labels. Uh, anybody yes. remember what is labels? Etiqueta. Very good. Etiqueta. So, uh, oh, something okay, went wrong okay. with the art. The art only, not the label itself. Very good. Any other question? That was a good question. Okay, uh, let me check if I can find some. Withdraw, rather discontinue. Um, what is higher? Es, uh, llevar, no, contratar. Contratar. Very good, that is higher. And what is a price? Prices. Precios. Very good. Uh, it's like... Uh, not price, but price, right? It's como premios. All right. If you don't have any questions, we are going to do the exercise number five. Order the words to create sentences. Okay. So they are uh, scrambled and we are going to unscramble. Uh, Roberto. Only teacher. Uh -huh. Only I uh, because I have to disconnect you. Um, because I I I stay out of the house, mm -hmm. and I I coming now. Okay. And apologize for that. No worries. Okay, thank you. Very good. Welcome to the class. Okay, my friends. Uh, uh Roberto Carlos, uh, were you able to check the this grammar? I can start revisar la gramática. Not because I, in this moment, I, I stay connecting. Again. Okay, let me repeat that. Okay, so you check uh, and then you are able to see or uh, to do the exercise. We're checking about rather uh, that we use with will, will rather. So will rather is the same as when you say I prefer, I will prefer. It's exactly the same. So we can say, for example, many companies will rather withdraw the product. So here we're going to use rather and then the verb that is next to that one is going to be the base verb. Not to, no ing, only the base, okay? Same happens with the other one. We will rather relaunch, not to relaunch or not relaunching. So only relaunch. And we can contract the wool with the noun. So if we contract that one, we can say they, they rather withdraw product, you know, or we'd rather relaunch the product than discontinue it. And uh, we can also use much. When we use much, with rather is to emphasize your preference. So it's stronger. Okay, so you can say, for example, something went wrong with the art in the labels of the product. I much rather hire a different design. So definitely, I really, really prefer something different, right? Um, did you get it? Or do you have okay. questions? Uh, not, I, I, I hearing and uh, explain, I, it's okay for me. Perfect. So now we're going to do the exercise number five. Order the words to create sentences. Compare your answers with a partner. So we're going to put in order everything and of course, we are going to use would rather, okay? So that is all of them. I will give you a few minutes for you to check into that one and we are going to check together.
Okay, let's check then. Who wants to share number one? Okay, Ramiro. Um, the creative team will rather us to design. No, uh, the manager. Excuse me. Excuse me. I, the manager will will rather us the creative team to design a relaunch relaunch of the product. Very good, that is it. So the manager would rather ask the creative team to design a relaunch of the product. That would be nice. Who wants to check number two? Number two, teacher. Okay, go ahead. Okay, many distributors uh, will rather much sell our product at a lower price. Perfect, that is it, that would be it. Many distributors uh, will rather much sell our product at a lower price. Perfect, nice. Who wants to uh, share number three? Okay, Juan Roberto, go ahead. They would rather withdraw the product that introduce it in new markets. Very good, perfect, that would be it, nice. Number four, who wants to share number four? I wanna share. Okay. Okay, uh, many companies would rather, would rather operate once the product is in the decline stage as a premium option. Okay, very good, perfect, nice. And the last one, who wants to share uh, number five? Me too, sure. Okay, go ahead. Okay, many more companies would rather become the low cost provider of a product with great caution about price wars. Very good. Perfect. That is perfect. All right. Let me check if uh, there is any uh, any word here that we have to check. I don't think so, but uh, we check what is the client stage. I remember. Okay. Uh, this one only. This says with great caution. What is caution? Precaución. Very good. Okay. About price wars. So that is something that happens. Price wars, right? Uh, a lot of companies, they are, as we say before, right? Launching promotions and things that. So, uh, for example, in cell phones companies, that happens a lot. Uh, they are pushing, they giving you more gigabytes or free navigation about something or many other things. And that is like a war because all the companies, they want to attract uh, other uh, other people. I believe that everybody receives calls from, from the company. Like, hey, would you like a better plan? Would you like a new cell phone? Would you, not, would you like another line? So that is price works, right? That is something interesting. I was checking also. I don't know if you saw that one. Uh, I'm kind of, you know, old, but since forever, there has been a war about Pepsi and Coca-Cola, right? That has happened. And that is from the 70s. It's a very old war. In YouTube, you can find the, the story, the cola wars, they say. And uh, it's very interesting because, I mean, they are sometimes, I mean, Pepsi, they have better commercials. And sometimes Coca-Cola has better commercials. But there was a winner. Did you know that? one of that companies won the Cola Wars. So who do you think was the winner of that war? In, in your opinion. In, in different company, is Pepsi is the number one. For example, in Guatemala, is Pepsi. Yes. In El Salvador, is Coca-Cola. In Guatemala, is Pepsi? 
Pepsi, ó, oh, cara. Yes. Interessante. Yes. Yeah, actually. In Russia. Uh -huh. In Russia, no, it's Coca-Cola. It's another drink. Vodka. Yeah, yeah, for the cold. <laughs> for the flu. Okay. Yeah. Germany yeah. is a beer. Yeah. Yeah, I, I prefer mm. I prefer go to Germany then. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, so that is true. In different companies in different regions, uh, one is better than the other. But speaking about the commercial uh, price wars that they had, the winner of that one was Pepsi, because Pepsi launched a very strong strategy. And at the end, uh, if you see the documentary in in YouTube, you will be able to see that it's very old but it's a nice one, you will see that there was a point where uh, Pepsi did something and Coca-Cola tried to copy that one. And then yeah. the next commercial of Pepsi was, we are so good that even the competency is trying to copy it. Sure, uh, I listened to the, the news and the, <clears throat> the employees that Coca-Cola sells the formula Formulas, uh, Pepsi. Uh, interesting. Uh, the Pepsi calls the general manager the Coca Cola. In, in, no sé cómo se dice. Le dijo, hey, mira, un empleado tuyo me quiere vender sus secretos. Pero no eran exactamente eso. <ríe> Lo denunció Pepsi que le querían vender lo, las las Receta, que no eran esas, obviamente, pero él sí hizo eso. Yeah, y claro, ganó hace como <laughs> seis años. Y yeah, imagine. Uh, actually, yeah. there is something that, that happens: a spy, uh, engineering spy, right? Uh, I mean, for example, in technology nowadays, Android and iPhones and some others. Uh, they are. They are trying to get the secrets of the other people. So sometimes it's kind of difficult, right? <laughs> very good, very good. Thank so you. uh, what we're going to do, let me see. We're going to do this exercise, number six. Okay, it says group work. Choose a renowned product or service, anything, okay, that is saturating the market, that you have a lot of product about. Okay, and we're going to answer these questions. What effects uh, does market saturation have in the price and quality of that product? What strategies are the competitor companies applying to deal with saturation? And what other strategies would you recommend? So I'm going to create a breakout rooms and I'm going to, uh, to give you the chance for you to discuss and then bring with the solution of this, okay? Do you have any questions about the exercise? Yes, teacher, is only speak or writing the, the choices? Uh, okay, you are going to discuss about the answers for this question. Only this okay. And then you are going to tell the class. Okay, okay. Okay. Is the working groups teacher? I'm sorry. Working groups, uh, the in, breakout yeah. rooms. Yeah, right now we'll be in, in in the breakout rooms. Okay, I'm going to send you this uh, just in case you don't have the book. I will send you this to the chat right now, so you have it there. Uh, there you go. Okay, I'm doing the breakout rooms right now and let's see how it goes, my friend. I will stop sharing just for doing that one. Okay. And here we go.
Perfect. Welcome back. So I really want to listen to you and check uh, what you are going to tell. So the first group was Aida Isabel, Ernesto Andrade, and Jose Alfredo. So the microphone is yours. Oh, okay, teacher. Thank you. Thank you for the moment. And uh, with Aida and Alfredo uh, are talking about the 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 three the three question. But for example, the first the first question uh, and answer is is uh, um, you talk uh, Alfredo. Okay. Uh, go ahead, Alfredo. Okay. Hello, partners. Hello. I. My question is, uh, come on, what my FS does? <laughs> Hola, amigo, ¿qué tal? What FS does those market saturation have on the price and quality of the product? Uh, I understand by market saturation that uh, there may be many products of the same line and different types. Uh, of quality, yes, and uh, but one of the effects that uh, market saturation uh, can have is the, the this these parts these these sad parents or or desaparición disappear disappears disappears of less com competitive companies and. And discredit pro, the discredit pro, 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 productivity, uh, poor process, uh, elaborate or the inability to adapt the product to customer demands. Demands, perdón. And my thing, my thing. Nice. Okay, okay. Okay. Go okay. Ahead. Okay. Alfredo and uh, teacher and colleagues, the second question and answer is given for Aida. Go ahead, Aida, please. Okay. Thank you, Ernesto. Uh, okay, in my personal opinion, um, I have seen companies, for example, the Super Selectos, uh, they have uh, one specific day that they can um, load to the price of the product. Uh, that is a good idea because um, it is about um, um, okay, control the saturation about the product. Of, um, in this time, people uh, have the opportunity to buy uh, the product, a specific product, and uh, the company have the, uh, the opportunity as well to sell all the, the product that they have um, in order to... Um, uh, low the saturation about the problem. Okay, that is my personal opinion about the strategy that the company has. Okay, perfect, very good, thank you. Okay, okay, Ada, thank you. The, the last one question uh, is what what other strategies would you recommend? Uh, in my opinion, uh, different strategies about the, is about the the promotion with the product is in the market saturation. For example. Uh, when the product is very close to break, uh, reduce the price in a specific week or a specific weekend. Another strategy, uh, I think, is temporarily talking a product of the market and then relaunch, uh, relaunch it with a higher price. It's very common, common, this strategy in the supermarket. In the last the strategy or the third strategy is uh, sometimes uh, joining two or three products in a price promotion in a short time uh, in a specific time for example uh, the end of the week the end of the month for example uh, this is our opinion teacher and colleagues 
Very good, perfect. It was very interesting, your opinion. So fantastic. On the group number two, we have Eric Reyes, Oseas, and Veronica Elizabeth. Come on, Oseas. Hello. Okay. Go ahead, Eric. You can do it. Okay. Good evening. Um, we are talking about our product, uh, one product in specific. Uh, it is about cell phones. And we are talking what, what can we do uh, to avoid saturation? And in this case, uh, that like I said, my partner, um, some uh, industries make a promotion. Uh, for example, in a specific uh, season or day. For example, uh, uh, Black Friday, they can sell. Uh, what? Well, uh, different type of cell phones, uh, less expensive. And in a few, in a few minutes and in one day in specific. And another day would be on Christmas because most of the people are thinking about uh, gifts. And that is um, uh, one of the, Give that uh, someone want in this moment, and the companies uh, sell this type of uh, product uh, like fast than faster than other than other seasons or days on the year. That's it. Okay, very good, perfect. All right, the group number three is uh, for Paola Hernandez, Ramiro, and Silvio Patricia. Yes, teacher. Um, I talking about the, 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 fear, the first uh, question, what effect does market saturation have uh, in the price and quality of the product? Uh, we talking with uh, pa uh, Paola, is a, a very important uh, when the saturation uh, market uh, have a problem with the low prices and low quality. But uh, Paola says another another important uh, uh, you you want uh, talking about uh, Paola. Yes. Yes. And we were talking with Mario about uh, clothing and cell phones. And we were saying that the effect of market saturation is that we can have products with low prices, but also we have low quality. And also what uh, Ramiro was saying, we were talking about, I want to ask how to say explotación laboral. Yeah, Teacher, labor, labor, labor exploitation. Labor, labor exploitation. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, because sometimes we, we are happy because we can buy a product with low price, with a low price, but we don't take the time to think why that product is cheap. And Ramiro, do you want to say something yes. else? Yes, he, no, no, no always uh, they have a, a cheap prices. Uh, uh, it's, a, it's a good, but it's a, uh, when it's possible, uh, it sacrifice the quality. I don't know this, let's say it uh, uh, well. Mm -hmm, yeah. uh, 
but it's a very important uh, uh, but uh, for the customer uh, is is better but have uh, many products uh, with low prices uh, but is uh, is possible have mm, very bad uh, quality okay, very good with, uh, go ahead uh, with the second one about the strategies that they use to to avoid the the um, market saturation uh, sometimes as we were talking in, in the class they use influencers so they give clothes to the influencers and they show how they look with the clothes and they can sell their products okay very good and perfect think, i'm sorry go ahead <laughs> sorry. Yes, i think indeed, that there. another Yes. Another strategy that they can another use. Another strategy is, is uh, uh, with a uh, recommend. Uh, uh, Paola say this is uh, necessary. Uh, 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 is watching to the don't uh, uh, the employees uh, have a uh, problems. It's very important. Okay. Okay. Very good, perfect, thank you. Interesting point of view, and you are right. Quality sometimes is more important than price, right? So depending on who's the product. The next one is uh, Mauricio Rivera, Monica, and Sandra Gomez. Hi, Hello. good evening, partner. Um, Mauricio and me is a conversation and, and the question. Uh, Mauricio, your your opinion number number one question. Okay, it's Sandra and I was talking about uh, about cell phones and clothes, but we mostly talk about clothes because clothes are clothes stores are a lot in the market. That you can see the 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 same the same brand launch a lot of different uh, clothes or like papayas or Zara and are the same owner. The same owner is the have the have different uh, stores, and you can see a uh, clothes selling or you can buy clothes in in internet like chain or something like that and it makes a, a market saturation and and it makes that that companies uh, i don't know how do you say uh, the price of, of the of the clothes are lower and the quality is lower and uh, for example in chain you can see disposable clothes and the clothes are making with bad materials or low quality materials and that's why uh, uh, the the market saturation have an effect in the price and the quality of the product Okay. Uh, other expectation will I recommend it is reduce the press in a specific time and in the case of for Christmas or Black Friday, uh, innovate new product, uh, the innovation. Innovate. I don't know. Yes. Mm -hmm. It's is that. Okay. okay. Yes. Ah, Mauricio, you were going to say something else. Okay. Uh, yes. Another strategy that the, the companies are using nowadays <laughs> is use uh, influencers. For example, Shane is the most common brand that use influencers. You can see how they unbox their clothes and they wear the clothes and they uh, make an opinion about the clothes for people 
can buy this clothes or this this uh, teacher is bad or the teacher is not the same that they sell in the in the page. So the most common yeah. strategy and clothes is is that uh, if you use influencers or famous people to to offer the the clothes. Uh, even the clothes is high, it, it's lower, low quality or something like that. Hey, yes. very good. Uh, okay. Go ahead. Okay, perfect. So uh, interesting, all the strategies. Um, and it's, it's very interesting. I mean, when you analyze all the things that can happen in uh, what products and quality, how everything is related, it's very interesting. Uh, we don't have more time, but tomorrow we're going to start with the rest, okay? We have still five more groups, I guess. Uh, on the next group, it was Blanca Tnaka, Jonathan and Victor Eduardo, then Ana Hernandez, Jennifer and Juan Roberto, then Carla Alejandra and Roberto Carlos, and the last one is going to be Maria Julia and Oscar René. Tomorrow we're going to start with this activity, okay? The other people that haven't uh, had the chance to speak today, of course, it's going to be tomorrow. And we're going to check the attendance because I know that you want to go to bed. So, uh, Aida Isabel Lopez Bonilla. Hello. Good. Ana Verónica Hernández Rodríguez. Present. Good. Blanca Isabel Punaca Rodríguez. Present. Good. Eric Enrique Reyes Martinez. Here, coach. Good. Ernesto Jose Andrade Medina. Here, teacher. Good. Ingrid Paola Hernández Tenorio. Here, teacher. Good. Jennifer Esmeralda Amaya Arias. Present. Good. Jonathan Ariel Figueroa Rivera. Jose Alfredo Hueso López. Present, teacher. Good. Juan Jonathan, Roberto. Present, present okay. teacher. Okay. Juan Roberto Velázquez Romero. Present. Good. Carla Alejandra Castillo. Here, teacher. Good. María Julia Ramos Olivar. Here, teacher. Good. Mónica Wendy Avalos Girón. Oscar Mauricio Rivera González. Here, teacher. Good. Oscar René Molina Calidonio. Present. Good. Oseas Figueroa Cisneros. Present. Good. Ramiro Rafael Aguilar Díaz. Present teacher. Good. Roberto Carlos Avilés Rivera. I'm here. Good. Sandra Yanira Gómez Romero. Present teacher. Good. And Victor Eduardo Reyes Navarre. Present. Very good. So my friends, remember tomorrow we're going to start with this activity, so please join early. And uh, it was a pleasure to be here with you. Have a very good night. Rest very well. See you tomorrow in three minutes. Uh, tomorrow, good night. Good night. Let's go. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye. Good uh, night. Teacher, I wanna, uh, I'm going to do the answer. Question, please. Of course. About me. About okay. me. I don't know. Uh, I don't I don't. I don't stay in the list. Ah, Veronica, let me check. Ana Veronica Hernandez, yes, no. you are the second one. Veronica Elizabeth. Mm. Ah, okay. No, you're not, but I'm going to check, okay, tomorrow with the okay. company. Okay? Thank you. Very well. Nice. Uh, bye. Bye. Yeah, Silva Patricia, sí, usted sí la mencionó. Oh, thank you. Okay, bye bye.